Hello everyone and welcome to Onik News. In today's topic we talk about HYBE officially designated as a major corporate group, making Bang Si Hyuk the head of the major corporation. This channel provides you with the latest K-pop and Korean related news every day, so make sure to hit the subscribe button for the latest news and trends. Today's video is sponsored by the new wave DGOD Din Hasty Clothing. Grab their free shirts giveaway by following them on Instagram at Din Hasty Clothing and comment which shirt you like from their website www.dinhastyclothing.com. So let's get it started. HYBE has officially been designated as a major corporate group, marking a first for an entertainment-focused company in South Korea to be recognized as such. On May 15, the Fair Trade Commission announced the designation of HYBE as a publicly disclosed corporate group for 2024, with total assets exceeding 5 trillion Korean won, approximately 3.85 billion United States dollars. Bang Si Hyuk, the founder and chairman of HYBE, who holds 31.57% of HYBE's shares, is recognized as the head of the same business group, Chable. This move reflects the expansion of HYBE scale alongside the global popularity of K-pop. According to HYBE's recent business report, its assets at the end of last year were valued at 5.3457 trillion Korean won, a 9.8% increase from the previous year, ranking them 85th in asset size. With Hybe's ascension to major corporate status, Bang Si Hyuk has joined the ranks of major conglomerate leaders. Amidst conflicts with Min Hee Jin, the head of Hybe's label Adore, Hybe's new designation and Bang's inclusion in the official list of conglomerate leaders by the Fair Trade Commission are drawing significant attention. Additionally, this designation makes it a first in South Korean history since the introduction of the major corporate group and Chable leader designation system in 1986, that two related individuals, Bang Si Hyuk and his relative Bang Joon Hyuk, chairman of Netmarble, which was designated in 2018, appear together on the Chable list. A Fair Trade Commission official commented, the rapid growth of the entertainment industry, fueled by the global success of K-pop acts like BTS and their key revenue from albums and performances, has been reflected in this designation. What do you think about it? Please let us know in the comments. This video was sponsored by DGOD Din Hasty Clothing. Don't forget to grab your free shirt by following them on Instagram at Din Hasty Clothing and comment which shirt you like from their website www.dinhastyclothing.com. Subscribe to our channel and get the latest K-pop and Korean related news every day. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.